Hello, this is my 15th playthrough of America Geez Alice. I'm sorry it took so long for me to put this Let's Play up. That's because my older computer had technical difficulties with it. But now since I have a new computer, guess what? It works great. So, I'm going to be able to uh, put my other Let's Plays up and, and finally end this game for, for, for good. So, uh, watch this all the main pop out of the wall. Yeah, that's good. Isn't this it? simple game is going to kill me. Distinctly nasty. Don't ever play alone. I don't intend to play alone. I never intend to play alone, Treasure Cat. That's why he's trying to kill me. Oh, yeah, the Jack and Ball. It's a great toy to use. Very good. I intend to use it most of the time. Because it's better than the ice, ice one, I think. It kills him a lot faster. See? Awesome. Now I have to get through here. To this crazy looking tube thing. That's black and white and... Whoa, okay, what the hell? All the maintenance saw me. Hit me. These things are annoying, but at least they don't drain any of your health, which is a, a very, very nice uh, thing for the game to do. Although they do drain your willpower. Not too bad, really. Around here, this, the main objective of this area is to try to destroy all the clocks, which is what I'm doing right now. And you gotta watch out for these spiders. And I'm actually gonna pull out the jack and ball, which I will need. Uh, <laughs> yeah, here they come. They were animated. These things are very annoying, also. They'll lunge at you to bite you, and if they do bite you, they will make you, uh, like, hallucinate. Make you look, make the screen look very, uh, freaky. I really don't want to demonstrate this because I'm playing on Nightmare. If I get hit though, you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. They also spit this poison out as their long range attack option. I'm not going to let him do that. I killed him. Which is nice. Because they usually follow me onto, into, onto that uh, twirly tube thing. I'm kind of lucky this time, I guess. Okay, that's that clock's destroyed already. Pro probably because the cutscene at the beginning of the Asylum level shows you one of the clocks being destroyed, and that's one of the clocks. Okay. Whoops. Don't want that anymore. <laughs> so I'm just going around right now trying to destroy all the clocks. And more spiders. Here's a spider in here. I can't remember if there are any other levels that have the spider uh, enemies in it. Looks like this one uh, is caught in a bad area, which is good for me. I can just sit back and just throw my toys at it until it dies. Thank you. Just imagine this is like a real asylum though. Huh. I like the imagin imagination uh, American McGee put into this game. And of course the rest of the, uh, the rest of the crew that made this game. That's why I like it so much. Alright, uh, we got some more spiders coming up here. And there they are. Okay, now they're following me into the uh, the tube thing. Come on, come on, come on. Throw your jack and fall at it. Come on. Kill, kill, kill. Kill, 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 kill. Come on. 
There we go. That's one down. Da -de da -de da. Go across the tube thing. And more spiders. Yes. I couldn't move because he was on top of my head. Pull out the knife. Go in here. Take out the clock. That clock. You're destroyed now. Okay, now uh, I believe. I think there's one more clock. In, yeah, there it is. These two spiders come down, and I'll have to fight them. Yeah, there it is. There is a screen. It really doesn't affect me much, though. It's it just. I guess it's like an effect that you see on the screen. It's not really. I mean, it doesn't really throw me off much. Although I hate when they bite me because it takes damage away. I don't want to die, you damn thing. Oh, now he jumped inside. I killed the one. Might as well get this meta essence now since he decided to come into the tube thing with me. Stop spitting acid at me. You bounced the other. I can't believe I'm taking so long trying to destroy all these clocks, but there's spider things, man. Ah, and there's like six of them coming after you. Not a good deal. Not a good deal at all. That should be the final clock. I think. Yep, sure is. And I think we have another area coming up. Yes. Banshees! Ha! Huh. I had to pull out the trusty ice lawn. Because I think for floating enemies it's better to use the ice lawn sometimes. Whoa, yeah. This part. I don't really like too much. Uh, I think that's these banshee, you screamer. There's the other boojum. This area got really watch out for the platforms. These things are very tricky. And they work against you all the time. So you have to be on your toes. If you're not, you'll end up in space. Something you really don't want to do. Or happen to you. And boo jumps here are very uh, relentless. So whenever you get the chance, you should turn around and kill them. Why aren't, why isn't this door opening for me? I don't understand. Is there something I'm missing here? There's got to be something I'm missing here. Do I have to kill all the enemies? Okay, if that's the case. Alright, there we go. I killed all the enemies, game. Now I have to make my way up to here again. Uh, is there a clock here that I have to destroy? No. No clock that I have to destroy because it's already destroyed. Yep. There's a. Is that a demon vial? That's pretty cool. But there's no enemies around here, so there's, I won't be able to put much use. I'll take it anyway. Yeah. Show your color red, Alice. Okay, at least I get to see her in this cool form for a little while. Why can't I get through here? Why? Why isn't? Why isn't this game letting me go through? Am I missing something? Is there some kind of uh, trick that I'm missing here? Because I don't remember anything like that. Okay, uh... Alright, take this. 
Spider-Sickle.